Do you think you would have enjoyed being a shepherd watching the sheep? I wonder why the shepherds are such an important part of the Christmas story. The shepherds and angels were the first ones to share the good news. How can we share the good news of the Messiah with other people? It was an ordinary night on the Bethlehem hillside. The flocks of sheep were in their fold for the night, and a handful of shepherds moved closer to the fading fire to stay warm. There was little talk as they huddled together. Being a shepherd was an important job, a responsible job. A good shepherd was on constant watch for possible attack by wild animals. And to protect the sheep, the shepherd carried a slingshot and a rod or club made from the large end of a tree root. With practice, a shepherd could hurl rocks with amazing accuracy with his slingshot. The rod was used just in close encounters. If the shepherd was really skilled with the slingshot, he seldom had to use the rod. These shepherds saw little value that night in casual conversation. What could they say that hadn't been said a thousand times? Nice clear night. Good to have water. One night was pretty much like one before, and they had no expectations of a more exciting life. Suddenly, the sky flashed bright as midday. The startled shepherds were immediately on the alert. What could this be? Then the winds began to hum a beautiful melody. The shepherds looked at one another in confusion. Just when they thought nothing else strange could happen, out of the wind came a voice. Don't be afraid. I bring you good news of great joy for all people. Today your Savior is born in Bethlehem. He is Christ the Lord. This is how you will know him. He will, you will find him a baby in cloths and lying in a manger. The shepherds stepped back in fear and wonder. Then they fell to the ground as the sky filled with angel voices singing praises to God and saying, Glory to God in the highest, and on earth let there be peace to God's people. Just as suddenly as they appeared, the angels were gone. The shepherds stood motionless, staring in awe at the place where the angels had been. Something wondrous had just happened. Finally, one shepherd broke the silence. Go to Bethlehem. The voice said, go to Bethlehem. So what are we waiting for, said another. The angel said, go to Bethlehem and see the Messiah. Let's hurry down to Bethlehem and see what the Lord has done. And so they went. And when they found the place where Mary and Joseph had taken shelter, they went in and worshiped the child. And like all who seek the Savior, they were warmly welcomed. The shepherds told Mary and Joseph of the song that the angels had sung. And when they left the stable, they told everyone they met the good news of the Messiah. Then they returned to their flocks. Life went on, but not quite as before. When you have stood in the presence of the Messiah, life can never be ordinary again. After visiting the baby Jesus, do you remember what the shepherds did? The shepherds were so thankful that Jesus was born, they told everyone they saw. We can tell others about Jesus, too. Who can you tell about Jesus' birth? Find on your map the town of Bethlehem and the city of Jerusalem. The fields between Bethlehem and Jerusalem are called the shepherd's fields. Put a green X in the fields between Bethlehem and Jerusalem. Our memory verse today is from Luke chapter 2, verse 11. Today in the town of David, a Savior has been born to you. He is the Messiah, the Lord. I'll say it first and you repeat after me. Today in the town of David, a Savior has been born to you. He is the Messiah, the Lord. Luke chapter 2, verse 11. Let's pray. Christ Jesus, Savior, Messiah, Emmanuel, God with us. The shepherds shared the good news of the Messiah with everyone they met. 
Help us also to share the good news of your birth, life, death, resurrection, and coming again with others. In your name we pray, amen. You know this my life, you were mighty to save. You changed my direction, you led all the way. You are my God, my refuge and strength. I trust that you will deliver this day. When I am in trouble, and I'm sinking low. Help me to know that you rescue me. 